इफ यू आस्क मी अमृत वट इज बीन द ग्रेटेस्ट मूवमेंट ऑफ योर लाइफ अगर आप मुझे पूछेंगे कि आपके जीवन का सबसे खूबसूरत पल कौन सा रहा है तो मैं कहूँगा कि 2016 में द वर्ल्ड मेमोरी चैंपियनशिप वॉज होस्टेड इन दिस ब्यूटिफुल कंट्री कॉल एज सिंगापुर एंड फोर्टी नेशन वर इन्वाइटेड वन ऑफ दम वॉज आर कंट्री इंडिया 140 करोड़ की आबादी का देश हिंदुस्तान नाउट ऑफ दैट सेवन ऑफ आस वर इन्वाइटेड टू रिप्रेजेंट एट द वर्ल्ड स्टेज एट द ग्रैंड फिनाले ऑफ द वर्ल्ड मेमोरी चैंपियनशिप लेकिन वॉट हेज बीन द ग्रेटेस्ट मूवमेंट ऑफ माई लाइफ when i was competing for those three days at the world memory championship at the end of the ceremony the greatest feeling was to hold the indian flag on a foreign land in 2019 once again i got the opportunity to represent india in china at the world memory championship wherein i was an official referee at the world cup but what has been the greatest learning in the last 15 years being a part of the memory sports fraternity and we are going to play a very interesting game right now for all of us to understand how our brain functions and how we can learn anything effectively so we're all ready for this so what i'm going to do is i shall be sharing a list of few items with all of you and we are all going to store them in the exact order your game for this let me share the first word in this list for all of you to remember is a toothbrush second one is an elephant carrot heaven mobile shop ghost torch fire building maggie snakes rocket kite dog ice cream sugarcane lipstick buffalo bmw car and the last one is c can you all recall all of them in the exact order <laughs> let's try it now i'm going to teach you united method and through this you'll understand how our brain actually functions and can store humongous amount of information in just short amount of time let's try this i request all of you to close your eyes so that you can all visualize better let's begin visualize that you're holding a huge toothbrush in your hand and with that toothbrush you're brushing the elephant's teeth and this elephant suddenly farts and from the elephant's fart carrots are coming out you throw the carrot up in the heaven and as you reach heaven you see there are multiple mobile shops you enter one of the mobile shops and a ghost attacks upon you the ghost takes out a torch from his pocket keep visualizing whatever i'm saying the ghost takes out the torch from his pocket he switches on the torch and from the torch fire comes out there's a pink color building that building catches fire aur ye jo building ke log hai bade masti ho rahe wo usi fire ke upar maggi garam karke kha rahe you snatch the maggi from their hand and you start chewing the maggi and you as you chew this maggi something moves in your mouth and you say ah say ah and snakes are coming out of your mouth these snakes now sit in a rocket and the rocket boom that goes up up there there is a kite and the rocket cuts the kite the kite comes down falling and down there is a dog who is a hungry dog he eats the kite he walks to a ice cream shop and he is buying an ice cream can you all visualize that he is buying an ice cream you take that ice cream from the dog's hand and you insert the ice cream in the sugarcane juice machine as the ice cream goes from one side of the sugarcane juice machine from the other side lipsticks are coming out you hold one yellow colored lipstick in your hand and in front of you you see an extremely handsome buffalo you apply the lipstick to the buffalo's lips the buffalo is very angry at you and the buffalo kicks the bmw car and this bmw car now falls in the sea and the sea water splashes out open your eyes and let's see if we can now recall these 20 items and i request all of you to answer them as i ask you questions let's begin the first word on this list you're holding a huge that's right you're brushing the the elephant farts and what comes out you throw the carrot up in the and as you reach heaven you see with shock who attacks upon you he takes out something from his pocket that's right and you switch on the torch what comes out fire what catches fire and building ke log bade masti ho rahe you put the maggi in your mouth and what comes out snakes the snakes are actually that's right it's a rocket and what the rocket cuts up there that's a kite 
right? And the kite comes down falling. Who is eating the kite? That's a dog. And the dog goes to buy something. That's an, you put the ice cream in a machine. And what machine is that? Sugar cane. And what comes out from the other side? That's right, lipstick. And whom did he apply that lipstick to? Buffalo is very angry and kicks something. BMW car. And where does this BMW car falls into? Please give a huge round of applause to yourself. That was phenomenal. As a first timer, you did a great job. And that's what we do as memory athletes day in and day out. We memorize humongous amount of information in a very short duration of time. That is memory sports all about. There are total 10 disciplines in the World Memory Championship, right from memorizing words to numbers to images to shuffle deck of cards, and there are total 10 of them. The sport is into existence for the last 35 plus years. India is primarily playing the sport for the last 15 to 16 odd years. But you have to share that in the last 15 years, we have been teaching and training students just like you how to retain and learn any information effectively. What you learned right now are the two fundamental rules of memory. And the first rule is, if you have to learn anything effectively, try and visualize that data. What's the first rule? Visualize the data. The second one, just visualizing is never going to help you. We got to associate what you visualize. So what did I do? I visualized a toothbrush and I associated with the second item on that list and that was an elephant. And then I associated the elephant with the carrot. And you realize the third secret is associating it creatively. Because I made the elephant fart. <laughs> and the reason why I did so, because I know when you supply associations which are crazy, which are unique, the brain remembers those associations for a longer time duration of time. My dear friends, as I share this data with all of you, very glad to share with each one of you, this year, the World Memory Championship is going to be hosted in our country, India. There are participants across the globe who are going to come here and compete at the grand finale of the World Memory Championship. 2013, I never knew that I am going to be a part of this journey for such a long time. 2023 was very special. I was on a global stage. Puri dunya mujhe dekh rahi thi. Aur meri aankhon se aansu nikal rahe. And you want to know what was the reason? 2016, when I went to India ko represent karne gaya tha at the World Memory Championship in Singapore, I had a dream and the dream was ki ek din aega aur hamara desh India is World Cup ko kabhi na kabhi host karega. Because uh, 35 saal ho chuke the, India had never seen a World Cup. Saat saalon tak wo dream mein chase karta ra. I kept meeting people, interacting with them, requesting them, being a part of the bidding process. Saat saalon tak us sapne ko chase karta ra. 2023 mein ये सपना पूरा हुआ और इंडिया ने पहली बार वर्ल्ड मेमोरी चैंपियनशिप को होस्ट किया 780 लोग फ्रॉम 13 कंट्रीज दे कंपीटेड अंडर वन रूफ इन अमची मुंबई दैट वाज वन ऑफ द ग्रेटेस्ट एंड द लार्जेस्ट गैदरिंग ऑफ मेमोरी एथलीट्स अंडर वन सिंगल रूफ बट ऐसा क्या था कि मेरे आंखों से आंसू निकल रहे 2016 में जब मैं सिंगापुर में था तो एक सपना था कि ये वर्ल्ड कप इंडिया में हो सपना इसलिए देख रहा था क्योंकि मेरी ये ऐसी तीव्र इच्छा थी कि जब ये वर्ल्ड मेमोरी चैंपियनशिप इंडिया में होगा तो अलग-अलग देशों के लोग वहां पर मौजूद होंगे और जब मेरे देश का नेशनल एंथम प्ले होगा तो अलग-अलग देशों के लोग उसके सम्मान में खड़े रहेंगे 2023 में जब जनगण मन शुरू हुआ मैं स्टेज पर मौजूद था और मेरे सामने जापान के मंगोलिया के जर्मनी के अजरबैजान से अलग-अलग देशों के लोग मेरे जनगण मन के लिए सम्मान करते हुए खड़े थे आज इस टेड 
एक्स का थीम है द करेज टू बिगिन 2023 में इंडिया में कुछ ऐसा कर दिया एंड वी स्टार्टेड द होल कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ द वर्ल्ड मेमोरी चैंपियनशिप इंडिया आज भी विश्वास नहीं होता दैट द वर्ल्ड मेमोरी चैंपियनशिप इन इंडिया इट हैपन अंडर द लीडरशिप ऑफ द स्लम बॉय झोपड़पट्टी में मैं रहने वाला किसी जमाने में घाटकों पर की गलियों में टू रीच दैट ग्लोबल स्टेज एंड टू हेल्प द स्पोर्ट एक्चुअली थ्राइव ग्रो टू एनकरेज दिस मेमोरी स्पोर्ट्स इन इंडिया हैज बीन अ वेरी लॉन्ग ड्रीम एंड आई एम ग्लैड दैट दिस स्पोर्ट इज रीचिंग दिस कंट्री टू एवरी स्टूडेंट आई विश यू ऑल हैप्पी मेमोरी and i request you all to keep showing courage each and every time thank you